Are yeah. you saying that people are too stupid? And so it's the job of... I'm saying, I'm saying that many of those who voted for Brexit knew what they were doing and voted in, in their own interest, but there's a majority of people who did not understand what they were voting for. They thought they were voting for one item, and in fact, they were voting for something else. So, Ta yes, a lot of them were enough, were uneducated and did not understand ah, what was put in front of them. The now, uneducated... Like go on, go on, Tony. Yeah. Make your next okay. point, because I'm enjoying okay. this so much. Okay, the next... Good, good. Uh, I hope you enjoy the next one as well. I think you're a racist, and I really take offense at the way you spoke about uh, uh, Romania and Romanians. Yeah. Uh, yes, uh, a lot, there are demonstrations because people oppose what, what uh, their uh, MPs are trying to do. But think about the British MPs who've been embezzling hundreds of thousands of pounds, and they are trying to get away scot-free. So what's the difference? I'll, that, tell, you, anyway, I'll tell you, Tony, what the difference is. I'll tell you what the difference is, that corruption is absolutely endemic right throughout Romanian society, and that is backed up by every independent report that comes out. And furthermore, Tony, it's a country in which up to four million people are viciously discriminated against because of their race. And I find it really hard to believe that we're in a political union with a country that's in a state like Romania. And that does not mean, Tony, that I'm saying Romanians are bad people. There are lots of wonderful Romanian people that I've met because they always come up to me in the streets and say I'm Romanian. And there are lots of wonderful people. But the country has not made the transition from living under all those years of communism to, be, to being a proper Western democracy. I still think it's absolutely plain wrong uh, for them to be doing it, uh, because they did delegate this decision out to us. Uh, but my real final thought is we are, I think, a few minutes away uh, from reaching the point of no return. And for someone like me, who was always considered to be a hopeless case, it's a very happy moment.